The same thing keep happening, but you keep doing it, but you're tired of the way the outcome is, but you won't change. You got to do something different. I've been seeing several posts on Facebook. After you tried everything else, try Jesus. No, baby, before you try everything. Whoa. Please don't try everything before you try Jesus. Try Jesus. I promise you, you ain't gonna want nothing else. You're not gonna want nothing else. Can't nobody do you like Jesus. Can't nobody do who? Can't nobody do you like Jesus. Can't nobody do you like Jesus. Like Bishop said, it's since I've been on the Lord's side. I can't give credit to nothing I said. But when I came on the Lord's side, everything changed. The good, the bad, the ugly. And I've been through some stuff since I've been saying, Ooh, hey, but ain't nothing like going through on the Lord's side. Joy. You can go through and still have joy. You can go through and still have peace. Hallelujah. You can shout. Those are all good questions. 
if you want to have a fresh start, you got to stop hanging with people that are going in the opposite direction from you. If you want to go in the right direction, get with some folks that's going in that direction. If you need to ride the wild horse, you need to catch riding with somebody that's going to the wild horse. If you're trying to go to the you need to get out on the with somebody that's going with the You got to separate yourself. You need to distance yourself, even if it's family. We should, as believers, spend time with our family. But when they want to hang around and rub that ball and talk about food shoes all the time, you got to cut. You ruin your witness. Then you can't tell them nothing no more. Then they're going to start talking to you about your sights. Then they're going to start telling you how it's supposed to be on the Lord's side. Well, if you know all that, won't you come on over here? But see, when you spend that much time with them, you put yourself in that predicament. It says, be not unequally yoked together with unbelievers. What fellowship have righteousness with unrighteousness? Those who are two separate things. What communion have light with darkness? Light and darkness is two different things, right? All right. Ten things you must do for a fresh start. And it's just ten. You might think of four. Just do it. Just start over. Forget the formal things. Get a minute, so again. Take it with me, please. Uh, number one is forget the formal things. It will only weigh you down and keep you from where you're going. Number two, do not dwell on the past. This just jumbles your mind with garbage. There's no room for garbage when you're making a fresh start. Fresh start. Start over. Wherever you need to start over. If it's your reading, the word, start over. And set a small goal. Don't try to read 10 chapters a day if you know you don't have that attention span. But say I'm going to read something today. Pray. Set your alarm clock if you have to. I'm going to pray five straight minutes and I ain't think about nothing else for the next five minutes. And then you keep moving it up. You set your alarm clock for 10 minutes. And you set your alarm clock for 15 minutes. And then you keep on doing it until you get to an hour. And then that's why you won't have to do it. Because the more you do it, the more you're going to want to do it. Start fresh in your marriage. If there's something going on in your marriage, fix it. Start over. Don't depend on the other person. You start over. I try to follow my husband's cues. And the things that I realize that he don't like, I try to avoid those things. I try to watch him on a regular and see, okay, I notice he getting irritated when this happens. I notice that this right here, and so I try to stay out of that in order to keep harmony. You know what I'm saying? Instead of doing this. Start fresh. See, take what I'm saying. Take it and apply it wherever it needs to go. Children, if you acting up in school and you didn't do good the first couple quarters, Start fresh. Start over. Wherever it is you need to start fresh, it's time. It's still time as long as you have breath. So number one on the last page it says, forget the former things. It will only weigh you down and keep you from where you're going. Number two it says, do not dwell on the past. This just jumbles your mind with garbage. There's no room for garbage when making a fresh start, right? Number three, acknowledge the fresh start is a gift from God. See that? That's a blessing. It's really a gift from God to be able to start over from scratch. Because guess what? Somebody was here last night and didn't get up this morning. Somebody had their clothes laid out and never got dressed. Somebody was planning on being at Bible study and did not make it. By the grace of God, we can't say that for where we fellowship at. Most everybody we know is still all right. Everybody doing fine, right? So we need to understand that a fresh start is a gift. He's doing a new thing in you. Do you perceive it? Can you tell that he's giving you a fresh start? If you sit right here listening to me, guess what? He's giving you a fresh start. Yes. Don't miss it. Don't miss the fresh start. Don't get sidetracked. It's so easy to get 
sidetracked. Even while I've been speaking tonight, things have been coming to your mind. Things have been coming to your heart. Some good things, some negative things. Kick it out. Yes. That what you need to keep, keep it. The negative, do what? Get rid of it. Fresh start. See, that's what got you there in the first place. If you, if something negative came, you gotta ask yourself, what made that negative come? I need a fresh start. Amen. Try new things. If you know the introvert, if you know the self person, maybe you need to start interacting with saints. Maybe you need to start interacting with people. Maybe you need to pick up the phone and start calling people. The thing that you hate about your church, maybe you the one that's supposed to be doing it. Why they didn't come to the Lord is because they scared they're gonna backslide. 